Online businesses are blooming and with more and more people coming online, online businesses will continue to be trending all over the world. But if you are still wondering which is the best online business to start as a beginner, keep watching because this video is for you. Hey everyone, I am Rahul from LearnTeacherWithRahul.com and in this video I will be talking about the best online businesses that you can start this year. A recent study shows that more than half of the world is online now. What does that mean? That means more and more people are buying online. More products and services are being sold online. And this trend will continue to increase. But if you are not ready with your online business yet, you are losing money on the table because your ideal customer is hanging online. With that being said, if you are ready to start an online business this year, keep watching as you will find out the best online businesses that you can start as a beginner. Number 1 is Blogging and this is where I started. No matter whatever online business you choose, you will need a blog to thrive that business. Blogs have existed for several years and will continue to be one of the primary platforms to get more visibility, generate leads and turn random visitors into buying customers. Why? It's because people love reading blogs and I believe anyone can earn money from blogging. Simply start a blog and make it profitable with your writing skills. Almost everyone has got something to share with the world. If you can write blog articles regularly, you can build an audience as well. And if you have never written a blog post earlier or don't know how to write your first blog post, I have already provided some actionable tips in the previous video. I leave a link for that in the description below so that you can check it out. Affiliate marketing is nothing but just word of mouth or referral marketing. You choose and promote a product by simply recommending it to your friends, family and audiences. If the person makes a purchase using your referral link, you earn a commission. That's how affiliate marketing works. But let's see this in real life example. Suppose you want to purchase a new phone and ask me which smartphone should you buy. Instead of just saying iPhone 10 is worth buying, I sent you a link to purchase it from Amazon. Since I am affiliated with Amazon, if you purchase using my affiliate link, I'll earn a commission from that. It's that simple. Affiliate marketing is the easiest of all and even a beginner can earn from affiliate marketing. However, it's worth noting that you will need an audience to earn from affiliate marketing. There are many ways to build an audience but having a blog or YouTube channel is the most popular ones. And if you need a beginner's guide to start earning from affiliate marketing, you may visit affiliatesalesmastery.com and download the free ebook for detailed step by step guide. The trend for vlogging is increasing. Video content is being consumed more than ever before and that is why YouTube has become the second largest search engine next to Google. If you are not creating video content, you are missing lots of potential customers. And the funny part is, anyone can create a YouTube video with the advanced cameras of modern smartphones. So start a YouTube channel and create videos. If you don't have a professional camera, no problem. Use your smartphone or even you can use any screen recording software and create videos on your Mac or PC. Upload videos on your YouTube channel, get more views and monetize it. You can sign up for Google AdSense program, enable ads on your videos and earn money. If you ask me which online business can be started without any investment, this one is for you. Freelancer is a term commonly used for a person who is self-employed and is not necessarily committed to a particular employer for long term. Almost everyone has got some skills. You must have some hidden skills as well. Maybe you are good at graphic design, coding, app development, digital marketing, creative writing or anything else. Just ask yourself what skills you already have. And once you know your skills, you can offer services and charge your clients for services you offer. You can create a profile on sites like freelancer.com, upwork.com or fiverr.com etc. Although getting your first client would be tough, but once you get a few clients and good ratings from them, your profile starts looking professional and you will start getting more clients as well. That's how you will earn more money in the long run. The good thing about freelancing is you are not committed to a particular boss. But the bad thing is it's just like any other 9 to 5 day job but with flexibility of choosing your own timing. So you will have to work hard and there is no passive income as a freelancer. There are two ways to sell products and make money. Either you can sell physical products or digital products. But whatever you sell it, you need to manage shipping, billing, customer support, refunds, etc. What if I tell you there is a way to sell products without going through these hassles? Yes, dropshipping is that hybrid approach to selling products where you don't have to go through all these. Dropshipping is a retail fulfillment method where a store doesn't keep the products it sells in stock. 
Instead, when a store sells a product, it purchases the item from a third party that ships it directly to the customer. Let's see this in real life example. You create a mini site like Amazon. You choose the products you want to sell on your store, import them from third party store using a plugin and so on your e-commerce store. Now you bring visitors on your store website, people purchase the product and the product is shipped and fulfilled by the third party store from where you import it. It's as simple as that. But the good thing is you can import a product for $10 and sell it for $20. That's a huge profit. Well, if you want to create an e-commerce site like Amazon, I leave a link in the description below. So these were the best online businesses that you can start this year. Of course, there are many other online business ideas as well, but I have selected only those online businesses that are good for beginners. And I recommend you to check out the resources I have mentioned in the description below. Because those are the tools you will need to start these online businesses. If you want my number one recommendation to earn money online, follow the first link in the description below. Hope you found this video helpful. If you enjoyed watching this video, please hit the like button and share with your friends. Also, if you have any question, let me know in the comments below. I'll be happy to help. And before I go, question of the day. Which online business are you going to start and why? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. This is all signing off and I'll see you in the next video.